The Ministry of Health continues to educate nurses in the areas of immunization and surveillance. A number of senior nurses in Antigua were present at the one-day workshop held at the Nurses Association headquarters on Wednesday. Terry Andrew has the details. As the movement of people increase and give rise to globalization, the borders around Antigua are much more vulnerable to the spread of communicable and other diseases. The importance of vaccination and surveillance are key areas which highlights the need for a workshop of this kind. Superintendent of Public Health Nursing, Coralita Joseph, gives the objectives of the workshop. The objectives of this workshop would be to update us on new information related to immunization, to inform staff about the situation of the surveillance and immunization surveillance, to identify and develop strategies to improve the gaps and weaknesses identified. Advisor Health Surveillance and Disease Prevention and Control PAHO and WHO, Dr. Theos Dos Santos is a presenter at the workshop. We're hoping here to discuss um, how we can maintain the achievements that we've reached so far and how we can address the unfinished agenda, the things that are still left for us to do, and how we can prepare ourselves to meet new challenges. Um, I would just like to reinforce the Pan American Health Organization's commitment to supporting Antigua technically and in any way we can see fit. And I would also like to offer myself and in whatever I can be of assistance and, and of help. Dr. Rhonda Seeley Thomas speaks of the topics that are very critical to our well-being in Antigua and Barbuda. Vaccination and surveillance go hand in hand. Vaccination, critical, not only to reduce the mortality or deaths and disability in our under five population, but also in adults. Adults are also prone, but children are also, but children are more prone than adults because of their immune status. So it's critical that we maintain our vaccination program. In Antigua and Barbuda over the years, we've um, provided vaccination through the expanded program and immunization through the Pan American Health Organization, the revolving fund, where we're able to access vaccines at a reduced cost. Safe, reliable vaccines, I might add. And not only vaccinate, but have surveillance, because it's one thing to provide vaccination. But how do you know that that vaccine is working? How do you know that you don't have cases still within your population? Surveillance, the continuing monitoring of diseases and analysis of diseases that occur is critical to any vaccination program. You need surveillance to make sure that your vaccination program is working. An expanded program on immunization, EPI manual, was launched at the workshop. A number of other presenters on a range of different topics relevant to the immunizations and surveillance were being discussed during the exercise.